There are so many people worried that AI will take away so many jobs. The worry is well placed. The general public understands AI as ChatGPT. That's not AI. We do need to really look at the reality of this. People need to be more aware of what that really means. I will play the devil advocates here. So are we asking uh, for the AI? Basically, we want it to be transparent, not biased, accountable. But are we asking it the same as asking for the humans, organizations, corporations, institutions? Because I would say not everything we have around us is fully transparent, completely unbiased, and really accountable for the actions. Aren't we asking for AI things more than actually asking for traditional entities? I was exactly thinking about this I mean, while writing the topics with my team. We ask AI, since AI is something outside humans, we are the one who gives input to AI. We are the one who decide where to place the output, so we are, we are still humans controlling everything. We need to also remember that there are at least three ways AI is present in our world. First one, AI is doing stuff automatically in 100% for us. Second, AI is augmenting our world. We are actually looking after AI. Trends are saying that the biggest impact AI is going to have is going to be in augmenting our work, which means that the biggest impact on us is going to be when we are actually leveraging AI to do something for us. How many users have used ChatGPT so far? 100 million users. The general public understands AI as ChatGPT, and it's very important for the general public to understand that that's not AI, that's just one tiny piece of a puzzle. And this generative AI, people need to be more aware of what that really means. That is just completing the next part of a sentence. It's nothing more to that. There's no, no sentience, there's no intelligence. I think the next gen of AI, it's gonna be more about these interfaces that interact with us uh, users it's kind of like a uh, chat GPT that's great with text and augmenting with other types of AI. There are so many people worried that AI will take away so many jobs. The worry is well placed in that we have crossed the threshold now. We need to be thinking along the terms of if something can be automated, it will be automated. So this involves a lot of education, looking to the next generation, uh, developing a workforce of generalists um, who are adaptable. But we do need to really look at uh, the reality of this, that a lot of people don't have that luxury to be able to reskill, uh, spend time educating themselves. I would say as a society, we already went through those cycles several times. We always got off the situations better with more food, more health, more education, more wealth. Yes, someone lost a job, but I would say most of the people found a new job. New jobs are being created all the time.